Yeah, I think I'm really close to the end, so this might end up being a bit of a longer episode. An extra bonus special long episode thing. Because I don't think there's any point leaving anything for next time. So I can't take any light bulbs with me. And this is just some eye candy showing you fancy stuff and lag spikes. Light balls that are doing something to the organic stuff. Did I want to be going around this way or the other way? Okay, it doesn't matter. And again! What is with all these doors? None of them are working. Fix your doors. Oh, there's a hole here. Wow, that's really hard to see. I mean, I guess it's not, but if you're flying, like, close to the wall, it's almost impossible to see. I guess you get this effect when you get close, but still. Uh, oh, I could go through. Okay, I thought it was closed. Can't go up these pipes. I can go down, it seems. Do I want to? I don't know if I want to go down or up. Okay, this one just pushes you down. Alright. Can go right, probably. Can't go left. Oh! Oh, these are the plugs. So I'm supposed to pull these out, I guess. I don't think I'm supposed to be doing this, but it's what you're supposed to do. Great! Hi! Can I carry this guy? Nope, I cannot. There's an invisible wall there, and I got sucked in. Man, I'm pretty sure I missed the elevator achievement, though. I'll probably have to look that up. Oh. Okay, so that opens. Let's wait with going in there. And I guess there's not much else. Well, up the pipe, I guess. And lag spikes while the level loads. And the outside. And glitchiness. This reminds me of Night Sky. Great. Wait. Hold on. What is this? Okay, it's a scanner, but I need some specific thing there. Alright, so I need to find a thing to put there. I can go through here. This... is this the elevator shaft? Maybe this is where you get the achievement. But hold on. So I don't really want to pull this yet. What is this? It's a battery, I think, so if I dump this down here... No. Okay. Is this what the robot is supposed to scan? Or maybe I dump this down here. 
No, that's not anything, apparently. This is nothing at all. I doubt this is what you're supposed to bring. I think I have to bring this down the elevator shaft. Yeah, this is definitely going to be a bit of a longer episode. We'll see just how long. Hopefully it won't be too, too long. I guess if it does end up being really long and I don't have anything to cut out, I might just make it into two episodes. But I don't think so, or I don't really want that. I see, and then I have to lift up these floorboards and input the battery. But yeah, this wasn't really an elevator shaft, so... Guess I'm not getting my achievement here. There we go. And... No? Nope. Is this wrong? Or is it just flipped? Do I need to flip this? What? Wait, what? Now I'm just confused. What the hell? What else am I supposed to do here? Yeah, that doesn't have power. And I can't pick anything else up. Now I am kind of lost. Oh! Oh, I'm not lost, I'm just dumb. This is a glass case, I just have to lift this up. Oh, it's not even a glass case, it's just an an empty battery right here, so I just have to replace it. Well, yeah, that was my bad, I didn't even see that. There we go. Makes sense now, makes sense. And I'm just back out here. Why am I back out here? Who knows? Am I going back into the room that was destroyed? Because I can't go back to the elevator, right? I think... Oh, I probably... Oh, I see. I probably need to bring this guy to the scanner. Yeah. Most likely. But I kind of want to just head back quickly to the elevator again. I don't think I can do anything, but I'm just gonna try it, and I'll probably be right back or speed it up or something. Oh, I can't. This is closed. Well, so much for that plan. So I definitely missed it, unless there's another elevator coming up, which I don't think there is, but I don't quite remember. We'll see, I guess. So I guess what you're doing is you're placing this guy who's broken to get analyzed and then the analysis thing concludes that it needs a power source or something and then you put that in the machine down there to get some power up or something. I know it's not just a power up, no it actually just opened. Then what the hell was this about down here? With the whole machine thing. Can I not do anything with this? Oh! What happened? What would have happened if I didn't do this then? Oh! Wait, what? Did I just miss an alternate ending or was there nothing to be done? Up there. God damn it, game!
Well, I guess that was unmechanical. And as always, I usually just do a quick review of the game, but I don't really know much to say about this one. I enjoy it. I don't think the puzzles are all that clever. I don't think there's too much to it. It's very simple, it's very short, but it looks nice and it's got a nice feel to it. So I don't think it's a bad game, but I don't think it's a great game either, really. Now I'm... oh! So maybe... no, it's fading out. Shit! Above average intelligence. I got that achievement at least. Yeah. Okay. I'm pretty sure I have seen the other ending. So if I click continue now, where will it put me? Puts me... right here. With... the battery... thing? Yeah, okay, so I'll do all this again and then I'll be right back. Alright, so let's just scan this guy instead, and as far as I remember, this just takes you outside. Like, it acknowledges that this guy has authority or something, or is authorized to go through here, and then you just escape this horrible place for whatever reason, I think. Nothing down here. And light! And the world! We are exiting into the world of sunlight and joy and happiness for all robots. Great! Credits the second time. Cool! So as I said, I honestly I'm not totally sold on this game, I think it doesn't have many problems, like it doesn't really do anything poorly, but it doesn't do anything specifically too well either, so I don't know, It's it's been really cheap at times, like I don't even know how much, but it's been in bundles, it's been on Steam sales, so I think it warrants just picking up and playing around with, so it's a good purchase, but it's not something I will remember forever and ever. And, as I said, this was basically just a desperation series in order to fill out the time. And we're back at the title screen again. If you haven't even seen this title screen, It's uh, it keeps changing. Every time you get to a new section of the game, it changes, so that's cool, but... There is still the helicopter achievement, and this video is going to be really long. So, to get that, I'm pretty sure I will have to... Let's just try this. If I click continue now, I think I'm just back there again. Yep, I'm just back here. So, to get that, you have to replay the entire game! Hooray! But, I have backups, I hope, anyways. I should have things backed up correctly, fingers crossed, otherwise I guess I have to replay the entire game, which I would rather not do for one achievement, but I don't know what I'm supposed to do about the achievements, so I will just look this up and hopefully I can restore my backup and get back to the elevator and maybe meet you there? So we'll see! Alright, so... My backup system did work, thankfully, and it's quite easy. I just backed up every everything in the my documents, my games, on mechanical folder. There was like a three different folders, and I just backed them all up and restored them all, and I was back to where I started this episode. So I also looked up the uh, the achievements, and it's fairly obvious. Hint, hint. I that was that was so weird because. I purposefully hit this thing to see if it would move, and I thought it didn't. I thought it was completely solid. I mean, obviously it doesn't look solid, but I don't know, I just didn't even think about this, but 
So the elevator is over here, and the hint is in both the name and the image, where the name says that's why helicopters need elevators, and the image is an image of a robot with a giant box on an elevator. So, yeah, I didn't quite interpret that correctly at first, and I didn't really pay much attention to it, but basically they're just suggesting that you have to place this massive box onto the elevator, because that's the reason helicopters would need elevators. To transport massive boxes, basically. So, I'll just do this, and it's gonna take a while. This is quite hard to to move. You have to sort of swing back and then forth in order to shift the weight because it's very heavy. And one more. Nope, not quite. And one more. There we go. And then we just enter here. And... I'll let you know when... I'll sit on this box, just in case. And drum roll, please! I'm not gonna do a drum roll. There we go, I got it! Well, that was a bit bit late. I'm gonna have to place that about half a second earlier. My little fake achievement unlock things. I enjoy doing those, they're fun. So, that's it. That's everything. I'm not gonna complete the game again. You've seen both endings, you've seen all the... Well, not all the achievements, but... All of the ones that I didn't already have from my previous playthrough, and all of the ones that were sort of difficult to get, I suppose. I feel like all of the ones that I didn't show are all either pretty simple or just sort of tedious, where you know what you're supposed to do, you just have to do it. So you shouldn't need help with those. So hopefully this series helped you out, or you enjoyed it, or something like that. But damn, Dreaming Sarah is still not out. I'm gonna have to think up something else to waste away the time on my channel, because I don't want to start something massive right before Dreaming Sarah. But I'll have to think about that, so this is gonna be one hell of an episode. I want to I want to keep this outro as short as I can, so I'll just say thank you very much for watching this series, I hope you enjoyed it, and perhaps I'll see you in another game. Bye bye!